The contents of this video might be distressing. A woman who was punched 107 times, kicked 85 times and stabbed 28 times, married her abuser. Welcome to AI Abuse Insights, where we hope and grow through action by doing something positively each day to impact people's lives. It was printed in the paper that a bodybuilder, Paul Bashi, sentenced to 14 years in prison for assault of a woman. Paul Bashi of Michigan in the US of A was charged with attempted murder and torture after attacking a woman. He was sentenced to 14 years in prison following the assault. Bashi was caught on camera brutally attacking the woman back in 2018. He was arrested and charged with attempted murder and torture, and he had no choice but to plead guilty. Get this. His attorney had requested for a new judge and prosecutor, claiming that the judge was biased simply because the accused man develops some health issues which he tried to use for a plea bargain. But the judge was not having it. I love this judge. I don't doubt for a minute that you're not the same person that was in that house and on that porch on that particular day some three years ago. Despite all your issues, you are not the victim in this case. You're not, despite everything we heard here today. It is the people, the state of Michigan that brought this case. You are not. I know you've been the focus, but you're not the victim in this case, said the judge. Bash your wife. And let me emphasize on wife. This is the same lady who this man had brutally beaten over a hundred and seven times that's punches, kicked, and stabbed. He then married her after the incident. So this is the wife. The woman who he had assaulted back in 2018 took to the stand and spoke in favor of her husband. Whew. She claimed that the bodybuilder, which is now her husband, slash her abuser has changed and has been taking the proper steps of recovery. My gosh. She said, I quote, the court has only seen the bad side of Paul. That's the abuser. Since he's been released, every day he shows me he, he's a changed man. Mm -hmm. He realizes his mistake and has changed for the better. Really. He goes to counseling, anger management classes, and domestic violence all on his own. You sure he's going there? Said the victim. I agree that he might not be the same person, but still, his sentence was handed down. And so he deserved. Despite his wife's plea, the prosecutor went over the details of the attack and just how disturbing it was. And I repeat what this man did to his now wife, the victim. He has punched her 107 times, kicked her 85 times, and with four different knives, stabbed her 28 times and my gosh this woman went and married this man now i am no expert here and i will not try to be but can anyone please who may know explain to me why would someone give the rest of their life to someone else who had kicked them 85 times, punched them 107 times, and with four different types of knives, stabbed her 28 times. Is there a real good explanation for this? Has she done it out of fear? Is this really what love is? Was she coerced into doing it? What is the case? Please guys, let me know your thought on this one. 
Thank you for watching. If you have not yet subscribed, be sure to do so as YouTube will notify you every time a new video is posted.